Nice. Nice. Yo, yo, yo. What's up, people? Tass around here. Welcome back to World of Warcraft on Chromicraft. Wrath of the Lich King. We're a rogue called Cutter and we're living the dream. Absolutely living the dream. Okay, so you see a couple of the achievements that I got from the fishing. Got it to uh, 75 over 75. Uh, so that's all we can do with that until level 10. So that's now up to scratch. So first things first is... Uh, now we're not going to be doing any of that for a while. I can actually sell the fishing pole. We don't need it. That's it. Jobs are good. And we can work on our cooking. So we can now make 41 of these small fish. However, I want to pick up a few of the mats for the spice bread. Uh, because quite simply, we need to. Uh, brilliant small fish stays red a lot longer than um, the spice bread. So if we do this spice bread up, we can um, get much higher on our cooking with the brilliant small fish. Now I'm thinking... Because I'm going to need somewhere to put it, really. Ideally, I need to make space. That's 77. Mining pick is 76. So, get rid of the mining pick. Because it's the cheapest to replace. Okay, so I'm going to, um, I'm going to make these, then I'm going to do another batch. Um, I'm, I'm about to do it like in two lots because of the uh, space in the bags. And then I'll bring you back uh, in a moment. Okay, so that's the two lots purchased. Uh, it's now green, and as I mentioned, the small fish is still red. So, it gives us a nice little head start doesn't it we're nearly at 40 already as soon as it goes to 40 that spice bread will be grey so yeah nice let's uh, let's get cooking get ready to learn some shit At the moment of spice wolf meat and I'm pretty sure that will be it but we'll see in just a sec okay so small fish is now green uh, but it has given us uh, three new recipes safe travel so we are now at that stage where we can buy the, uh, the long jaw mud slapper recipe but I'm not sure how much it is. I don't really want to spend too much. Three fucking silver. And I've got what five. See, pickpocketing is going to slow down a little bit now because our stealth is uh, shit, and things see us and everything that we can pickpocket now is going to be aggressive rather than passive so it's not like I'm going to be able to spam pickpocket like I was doing in Northshire so I'm not going to spend that yet be careful not at all so as I mentioned in the last episode, the first thing I want to do is do the low level, I think they are level 1 quests in Stormwind. Also get the bag sorted out and get ready to get some insane leveling done. So I will uh, bring it back in a sec. Okay, just went AFK for a sec, but we are now back 
and we're in Stormwind. And as you can see there, I have had a guild invite. The, the guild was called Endurance. So I went with it. Purely because it sounds like a Christy guild. So at some point, I am going to want to see what the... Uh, Hello. See what the tabard looks like. Around. So that's the first quest. The second one is in here. How are you? And I tend to do these regardless of uh, what level they are, or what level I am at the time, because at the end of the day, it's still Stormwind Rep. And Have boom. a good one. And before I carry on handing those in, we're just going to break away while we're at this end and uh, have a quiet word with the mining trainer. Because, as far as I'm concerned, the sooner I can. Uh, the sooner I can start building up that skill, the better. Because I want to be, ideally, I want to have mining of 65 and be able to pick up tin by the time I get to Westfall. I think that's going to be really important. There is a lot of tin, potential tin, in Westfall. I mean, I think, you know, it's going to be a couple of episodes before we get to that point. Of course it will. But, uh, it's all good. So, Dwarven District for Mining. You got my attention? Yes, please, sir. Beautiful. Good. Sweet. And I have got a mining pick, haven't I? No, I got rid of it. So Hello. Let's, uh, replace that while we can. Keep your feet on the ground. And I believe that's it. Someone put intellect on me. I'm not sure if intellect still increases. No, it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't say anything about the same as what it used to do in classic when uh, intellect actually made it your weapon skill increase uh, quicker. Don't look like that's a thing. I also want to have a look at the fishing supplier to see if they have the strong fishing pole available. But it will end up just going straight in the bank. I don't want to carry it. As I said, I can't do any more fishing until level 10. But if it's there, you know, it's usually one of those items where there's only one in the stock at a time. Hello. And there's not one there. Oh shit. Safe travel. So not spending any money yet. Sprint wouldn't go miss. Can't remember what level you get it. I think it's quite early. I don't think it's level six. It might be level eight. Greetings. 
be careful. I'm not sure. I'm just gonna drink that down. So one more quest to hand in, and then I think it's uh, get our lovely bags from Cathena. As I mentioned before, I apologise if I didn't pronounce that right, but a shout out to you anyway. I'll tell you what, they're getting a lot of, like, just random... Invites. So 30 online, 173 people in the guild. They got some, something mentioned about the uh, molten core in the in the guild info. So we've got, you know, it's going to be a raiding guild. So we'll have to see how it goes. Can't wait to put on these bags. Sixteen slot bags. I mean, talk about spam the dungeons. Ideal for a mage, really. You know, if you're going to go out and do sort of like the AOE grind, and which I would like to do at some point. The only reason why I haven't done a mage um, is because uh, my good friend Yulo. Uh, is also doing a Let's Play on Chromicraft. The series is well on the way. I suggest you go check out his uh, channel, Yulo. Uh, but he's doing a Let's Play of... Um, a mage. Sorry, I had a bit of a brain fart there. Right, this was the letter that I wanted to... Send. Yeah, Kathena. Kathena. I mean, that's how I read that, but thank you very, very, very much for the bags. It is uh, simply awesome. So, yeah, I did send the 10 silver, and uh, we've got a 14 slotter from my main inventory is full. Not fucking likely. Oh, would you look at the bag space on it. So we can literally just concentrate on just playing the fucking game. Oh, so good. Right, move that up there. Move that up there. Consumable. Potential mats. And that 10 silver, as I mentioned, sp specifically uh, that I wanted to do this as a sort of off my own seam. So, hey there. that 10 silver is definitely going on the bank. Which I can put that away. See you so, that is insane. That is insane. Thank you very, very, very much. Awesome. I mean, I wouldn't be able to tell you, I mean, maybe retail, but I wouldn't be able to tell you time in any of these sort of private and classic servers when I've had 16 slot bags. You know, you push up to a 14, although I suppose the traveller's backpack, you get the odd one or two of those, don't you? But these are particularly expensive, so I, I really do appreciate that. Okay, so I do have an auctioneer add-on, so I know that I can just put everything into whatever it uh, says. There are a few occasions when the current bid is like lower than what you would get from sending it to a vendor, which I really don't understand. But just a couple of those sell. That is going to be extremely helpful. So what else do I need to do here? done the bags, done the auction house, I've done the mining, I've done everything. I can't do weapon skill training till level 10. I know that's how it was on classic. I don't know if it's still the same. What can I do for you? 
I just can't afford it. So no, no level requirements. Just that. So it's no good doing it there. We've got these three quests to do uh, below gold shear, but there are more quests to pick up. So this episode is really going to be in preparation for going in the mine. Uh, so the first thing we need to do is head back down to well, gold shear. Okay, here we are. Are we ready for this? I am. I am very, very ready for this. And that was something I can pick up. And we have a sheep. And I think that's pretty much all of the critters left. with as many of these balls as possible. Because we are going to need four of the ball meats uh, for the quest. I'm, it's not something I'm panicking about. I know we're going to have more than enough. Wow. First mining node, nice and early. That's uh, that's special. That is special. Okay, I want to avoid the spiders because they don't actually give us anything we need. If you're leveling a night elf, then the small spider legs, or whatever it is that's small that you get from them, is used for the cooking recipe for that area but for us just simply don't need it okay so we're only level five we're not going to be able to pick up the quest for princess it looks like we're going to be up against it as well. There is a few people here. That's nice. Makes it feel, you know, a bit populated. Not overly populated. But not lonely. Which is quite nice. You need something? So I'm just going to show you how awful the stealth is. No, it actually went quite well. But they do see you um, from quite a range. You know, the stealth is a lot better if they're like one level below you. See, this one's at equal level. Oh, shit. Means he's now facing that way. Oh, shit. See? He saw me whilst I was stealthed through a tree. That's how bad it is. I must have, like, stepped on a twig or something. But I can't help myself. I am going to be specking to stealthing, movement stealth, ambush, backstab, high crit. It's how I roll. I don't care if it's the best or not. I, it doesn't interest me. I just enjoy it. For the alliance. Just so I can say I've done it. 
even though there's no experience or rep or anything for it, I'm not sure whether or not it counts into the, uh, you know, 50 quests completed. Hello. Okay, so we are still one boar meat down. Simply because I want to be level 6 before I go into the mine. Otherwise, I'm going to have no hope against Gold Tooth. And depending on how many mobs are there at a time, we might struggle with Gold Tooth anyway. I'm not wearing any trousers. Awesome, awesome, look there's loads, but these are in the direction that I want to go, so I'm going to do these ones. This is good, this is money, this is what, I'm just scraping money off their ass. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm just going to literally follow him. Nice to find someone that actually loots their corpses. It means the world to me. And we've got some copper ore, and as nodes are rare as rock and ore shit. Try and treat it as a bit of a priority. Hopefully, I don't pull anything. Good day to you. See you later. Smashing these out now. Smashing these out. So, how much do I need? 446. I've got a feeling. Good day to you. Safe travel. Greetings. Farewell. Oh, yeah. And Hello. we can pick up Princess Quest as well. Awesome. Right, so we just need to go back to Billy and then head to Goldshire. And train up uh, our level six rogue. I'm also tempted to do the, you know, for this escape quest. Uh, you know, speak to William Pestle. That was it. Note to William. Get the kelps and do that before going into the mine because that will give us some more mi uh, minor healing potions. And I think with my current sort of level and gear and everything. I've got a feeling we're going to need some potions. So yeah, let's do that. hoping to get a couple of the tunnelers sort of on the outside and 
get as many of the candles and dust as I could before I went in there. And that way I know that once I've done Goldtooth, and hopefully be finished that quest, I can just hearthstone directly out. I can hear something kicking off around me, where's this? That's in the mine beneath me, but look at the nodes in there! So they're still in there when I do go in. It's risky. see any nodes out here though but that's all right we've got um what six that's not bad only linen cloth only the one linen cloth gonna need to work on that let's get a few more skin in Not too worried about the points for skinning because as I said I'm not going to be keeping it. So I won't ever, you know, purchase the next, you know, up to 150. But everything I'll make will sell. It just will sell. There's just no two ways about it. Let's go. See you around. No, don't you dare get the rogue shit. Now hopefully it's gouge. What can I do for you? It's gouge. And sinister strike rank two. Beautiful. Farewell. Awesome. That means that I can still range pull. And I can still have the benefit of a backstab. Because I do love a backstab. Have I got anything worth using or keeping? No, not at all. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, so I'd like to get these uh, murlocs from the top side of the lake. Is that one is level seven, so I'm gonna range pull him. And miss and carry and it's not gone well. <laughs> it's just not gone well at all. Scroll of Protection. You know, I'm not a tank, but all the time I'm doing this in my pants, that's, uh, that can only be helpful. I've probably got a run on it. There we go. Still no kelp though. Is that one on its own? Yeah, let's have it. Oh no. Hey. Right, 
right, oh, there is one here. Oh, two, bad. This might get a little tricky. Try and save my energy for this one. Am I going to need a potion? No. Have I got anything to eat? We've got an apple. Beautiful. Although we've got that little health at the moment. It really doesn't take, <laughs> take that long. Um, yeah, so taken on two. It's really ill-advised right now, I think. If I can get some big crits in, the battle doesn't last anywhere near as long. Come on. actually see that was a risky pull that could have been any number of them. But finally got some points on throwing Bloody hell, I didn't see that. Got a feeling there's more, yeah. Okay, we've lost blessing of might, that's might make a difference into how quickly we kill these. I need them to die quick, especially if I'm taking on two. That's how many there? Three. That kind of works. Okay, are these just respawning really quickly or? Four for four. Try and avoid the rest of them. Don't need them.
don't think boar meat's any good for us now. Green. You know, considering the uh, the mud slappers that I've got, I might be better off just selling the boar meat. I would like to start thinking about getting some actual buff food though, so I should really start slapping a few wolves. Hello. Hello. Have a good one. Good day to you. The escape. See now give later. us five more potions. Beautiful. Sadly though, that is all the time I've got for this one. Thanks all for watching. I do really appreciate it. Let me know what you think in the comments and I'll see you all in the next one.